When we were on the ferry over here, the guy was telling us that there's jellyfish everywhere. But I asked a local Floridian, she told me. <laughs> <laughs> These are blue moon jellyfish, which apparently they are a little less venomous. I don't know the word for it, poisonous than the Portuguese jellyfish. So we might be in pain, but we will not die. That's the <laughs> good news. Yeah. <laughs> Guys, it is birthday boy. Yeah. Jared Big yeah. Out everybody. Yeah. Guys, we have come down here to West Palm Beach to hang out with my brother, my one and only little brother, Jared Bingham, everyone. We guys, just... West Palm is dope. So to be here with these guys. I know, it's gonna be so fun. Can we just talk about the fact that this is the second birthday he's had to spend with us? Oh, yep. not had to. Get <laughs> to. <laughs> yeah, Get thank to. you, Brittany. Yeah. Thank you, Brittany. Can I just Force remind to. you that? <laughs> can I just remind you that last year we were in Orlando with our whole family oh my gosh. spending his birthday at Disneyland. And Disney it was World. Awesome. The Seriously, best so much fun. Trip ever, seriously. So, you guys can really talk to us. <laughs> is the yacht next door? Is that why we're here? <laughs> Surprise, guys. You guys, these guys already surprised us with Bahamas. I mean, yeah, it just doesn't they get did. better. It gets, it gets better. <laughs> <laughs> it gets better. Oh. We're running from the cops in the <laughs> <laughs> No, you guys, actually, Brittany spent so much time making today oh. so special for Jared and preparing everything for us. Good. You guys, these two are incredible. The way that they host everyone when they come into town is unreal. We we're just talking about this over on their vlog, which by the way, if you haven't seen Jared and Britt, go over and check them out. They are always doing, I mean, seriously. Just for this. Just for the hard. dance moves, you guys. Honestly, no. They do so many fun things. They live here in Fort Lauderdale, but they had family in town up until the day before we got here. And then they've been with us. I don't even know how Brett had time to prepare for his birthday oh. today. Super women over here. They planned this super fun day, West Palm Beach, yes. starting at this amazing restaurant. We're going yes. over to Peanut Island. You guys, we're gonna have so much fun today. It's gonna be awesome. Oh All about gosh. Jared. Yeah, whatever you want on your birthday, man. <laughs> we are in West Palm Beach, a place that Lindsay and I have never ever been to. Guys, this place is spectacular. We're talking like very schwanky up here. I want some fancy sauce. Yeah. I'm not done using it. Jared and Brittany are like, hey, be prepared to see some of the most incredible homes you've ever seen in your life. Like this is, I think Donald Trump has a house over here. So super nice area. They're gonna show us around. We're gonna do a little snorkeling today. But today's a very special day because today is Jared's birthday, everybody. Jared turned the big three six, I think. Man, we're getting old. So Brittany surprised him with a restaurant over here called Elizabetta's. We've never been here before, but guys, come check this place out. It is spectacular. It has that Italian vibe. As you guys know, I lived in Italy for a couple years. Lindsay and I visited there with Turin when he was 18 months old for about two months. Habit of poopy. Get calls on. We love the Italian culture, so this place brings back all the warm things of Italy. Check this place out.
you guys. For this birthday boy right here is providing first class service for us. Yeah, happy birthday to me. <laughs> He's just digging us a hole right now. I mean, really, look all the stuff that they packed for us. We've got beach bags. We, we, we actually brought the underwater scooters, but they've got snorkels. They've got this shade for us right here. They even brought a guy to dig us a hole. Right. We've got paddle boards, two of them. All of this is like not easy to bring along with us. We've got more snorkels over here. Brittany brought us some. Oh, we got some Oh, the good stuff. In fact, Brittany introduced us to this on a girl's trip. How much do we buy these now, Jet? It's a fave at our house. Um, yes, please, Nerd Gummy Clusters. I ate all of Lindsay's yesterday, so. <laughs> and she got a different flavor this time. These are so good, I love this licorice. She's got drinks in the cooler. You guys, look where we are. We just took a ferry over to Peanut Island. Peanut. Look at the water. It is crystal clear, aqua blue. Right over here, they're telling us there's some snorkeling out by these rocks, some beautiful fish. Actually kind of a crazy story. We called on our way to the ferry from breakfast and said, hey, we're coming. We wanna make sure there's still spots on the ferry and we were told that they were sold out for the day. It's Labor Day weekend, it's slammed and the city actually stops them from letting people come on the ferry at a certain point because the island gets so full. So we were like, oh, and then Brittany had the idea, why don't we just go over and, and check? Like, why don't we just go to the ferry and make sure that there's not a few spots left. So Justin and Jared get out of the car and buy the last four tickets of the day. The last four. That's right, baby. It's a birthday miracle, everybody. So we got on the ferry, came over to this beautiful island. I've never seen so many boats in my entire life. It's a party over here. It's absolutely gorgeous. The guys just took off to go snorkel over by the rocks. We're gonna go join them here in a second. Two people on the beach just came out of the water saying they got stung by jellyfish. And we were on the ferry over here. The guy was telling us that there's jellyfish everywhere. <laughs> But I asked a local Floridian, she told me. <laughs> These are blue moon jellyfish, which apparently they are a little less venomous. I don't know the word for it, poisonous, than the Portuguese jellyfish. So we might be in pain, but we will not die. That's the good <laughs> news. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Pumped up the paddle boards and now they're going on a little adventure Oops. to the bridge. The paddle boards are not easy to pump up. It's a lot of work. I watch them. It's a lot of work to watch them. <laughs> so they're heading out to the bridge. What are you supposed to find at the bridge? Supposedly, Jared says there are sunken boats over at the bridge. And the snorkeling over here has been it's been good. A lot of jellyfish though. So if we're gonna do a try our luck over at the bridge, because at the very least seeing a sunken ship, it's kinda cool anyway. And they've been itching to use the water scooters again. So they're taking the water scooters with them. The current's a little strong though, so they're not sure if they're gonna make Get back make to it back to us. So they might we be hope. deserting us. They might just be leaving us here on an island. We take you now to a desert island. Right now you're just gonna chill, hang out here, enjoy the beautiful beach, the waves, the breeze, paradise. Let's look out for the jellyfish. All right, you guys, Jared and I have come out here, middle of the bay. There is a party out here. We're heading down over to where these sunken ships are. Jared's never done it. I've never done it. So, so you know what? Let's just go do it. So we've gotten separated of some sort, but we're heading to that bridge over there. We're right here. Guys, I just paddled over a big stingray. Beautiful out here. Okay, just talked to the guys. They're out on the paddle boards. They made it to the bridge. Said there's a lot of cool stuff under the water. They said they have a million jellyfish bites, but it's so worth it, in their words. My jellyfish brothers, Moyoko! So, Britt and I have just been enjoying this beautiful beach. Just hanging out, relaxing. It's, it's been heaven. Absolute heaven. You guys, it's gorgeous. Like, look at this back here. This is just in your backyard. It's crazy, guys. It's so pretty here. It is so pretty. Minus the jellyfish. <laughs> no, honestly, the jellyfish have been a fun little 
little adventure. I've been stung like five times and it doesn't even really hurt that bad. It's fine. Should we compare who has the most jellyfish steaks? Yes. Yes, it's a competition. I think I've been the only one that has not been stung yet. So, I know that. She's the winner. She has no steaks. I'm probably gonna jinx myself in the last little bit here. Big old starfish down here at the bottom. Now, as we came over here, someone said there was a big old manta ray. We have unsuccessfully been able to actually see that manta ray. We do not have a dive flag, so we were trying to be a little bit cautious. In fact, the sheriff came over here and said, hey guys, you really need a dive flag. So we're probably gonna jump out of the water because we do want to play it safe. However, no boats are allowed in this area. The main channel is this way, where all these boats are going. They have to pass through these gates right here. So we are in somewhat of a safe zone. Regardless, we are trying to play it safe because there's a lot of people out here today. But Jared's loving these underwater scooters. These, these things are so fun. I literally just found them on Amazon. They're unbelievable. So ladies are in line over here on Peated Island. Boop. So they're actually over there in line to get back on the ferry. We paddle all the way over here. We might have to paddle all the way back over there, but you know what? It's okay. We're having a good old time. Guys, this is the life out here in Florida, West Palm Beach. I seriously love it. I seriously freaking love it out here. All right, we've officially made it back to wherever else that we started, actually, the Peanut Island Shuttle Boat. So guys, yeah, actually, Jared and I, I would say almost paddle around the entire island with the exception of maybe less than a quarter of it, probably. In fact, I'd say maybe less than a fifth or a sixth of it, because we actually started here, which is towards the latter two thirds of the island, and then went around, right? Stopped, walked up a bit, and then we paddled all the way down and then around back over here to the bridge. So we actually did a decent amount of paddling. I would actually assume it's in the range of a couple miles worth of paddling. But uh, we're back now. The ladies are about to pull up right now as we speak. Oh, Jared's calling, because Jared actually is not with me. He's somewhere else. Let me see what he's saying here. 10 seconds later. Okay, just got word. Oh, there are the ladies right now. Jared is at the car. He already made it to the car. And here are the girls. There are my ladies. Hey guys, we're back. We made it back. The boys had so much fun together paddling out to some bridge. <laughs> And we had the best time just hanging oh out on the beach. It was heaven on the beach. It literally was. <laughs> Hi, birthday oh, boy. <laughs> hello. <laughs> there may be some jellyfish stings going on with oh, them, yeah. but regardless of that, Jerry I got says all he up my arm right here. All right there. Oh my gosh, I can see them. Yeah, you see them all right they there? They almost look like mosquito There's bites. Tons of them. They just what? hurt a little bit more. Yeah, you see them all? Hey, do you think you got 36 because you turned 36? Oh! oh right got them table. all right here. Uh, uh. <laughs> oh. I'm going to need a few more. <laughs> I'm just so glad that you guys left so I could hang out with Brittany. <laughs> yeah, oh, okay. sorry. Mm -hmm. All right, now let's see you guys. <laughs> yeah, bye. No, but really, you guys, I love this girl oh, so much. She's the girl. sweetest ever. She's the biggest blessing in my life. Our whole fam loves Jared and Brittany. They're the best ever, you guys. The most genuine, kind people on the planet. And we just have a few more hours with them. They're taking us on a cool drive, a beautiful drive yes. through all of West it's like, Palm. Yeah, West Palm. It's like a highway that goes through all the beach cities or no? Yeah, so on A1A, we're taking them along there along West Palm Beach that goes all the way along the ocean. You guys, who home. has like a tour guide when they come on vacation? <laughs> you guys do. That is we nice. do. You don't want them to leave. We I seriously love her. them so much. I'm going home and I'm planning our next She's trip. Coming back. She's That's coming right. back. Jack can stay at home. Lindsay's coming back. That's right. <laughs> coming back alone. Girls trip, baby. The Justin is so boring.
cooking way. You're kidding me right now. It's not broken? Oh, yeah. oh my gosh. You guys, I'm in literal shock right now. We're driving through West Palm Beach. Justin's flying the drone. So beautiful out here. And then all of a sudden, the battery's low. He loses service. We have no idea where the drone is. He can't get his phone to connect. Like everything that could go wrong. Like the phone won't even <laughs> register. <amazing. laughs> the phone won't amazing. even register that he has the drone on him. No signal, no battery, and the only thing is we could we could kind of get an address to show up. So I'm trying to map where the address is. And all of a sudden, Justin's like, "Oh no, it's force landing! It's force landing!" He has no idea if it's out in the ocean. We're like literally like driving along the ocean right now. It landed actually in a <laughs> flat area too, not a single blade broken. I mean, it could have been like in someone's backyard. There's like mansions over here. It could have been in the middle of the road and run over. Yeah. He had no idea where it was. It was like maybe what 10 feet from the road, 20 feet from the road. Yeah, in yeah. a nice little bushy oh, area. Yeah. It was probably. 10 feet from the road and 10 feet from the ocean, wouldn't you say, Jared? Hell yeah. I mean, I don't know how. It somehow landed on the beach, right? On the sand? Yep. Well, it, like, it landed in like, <laughs> the, like the shrubs. So his phone turned on enough for us to like find where it landed. Justin has to like kind of hop over this fence that you're not supposed to go across just to get to the beach. And he finds it and it's completely untouched. Dude, I can't believe that. That's so nerve-wracking. How? I know, you're How? Like, what the heck? I honestly thought for sure it was goner. It was, it was gonna be crushed, oh, broken oh in the gosh. ocean. It has all of our good footage on wow. it, too. Save the footage! <laughs> Uh, we're saying goodbye. Oh, we're saying God. goodbye. I'm legit sad. It's the worst me right now. Yeah. <laughs> Stop it. Stop. You guys, our time with Jared and Britt has come to an exciting end. <laughs> <laughs> we're so sad. I'm so sad. No, really though. It has been an absolute blast hanging out with these guys. It's, I feel like we've seen you recently, even though we really haven't. But yeah. guys, it's always a blast <laughs> hanging out here in South Florida with Jared and Britt. Their life out here is absolutely incredible. Incredible. They've got all the cool gadgets, all the That's cool nice outdoor gear, all well, the cool all destinations. The well, it was on our and screen. you took us to the cool destinations, so yeah. yeah. But, new guy, happy birthday, man. We love you. Thanks, we, dude. we said all the things we love about Jared at breakfast, uh, brunch this morning, so we won't share those oh, with you. Which they got for us, by the way. So yeah. sweet. I, I know. Thank you, thank you. You guys, it's so easy to say nice things about Jared. So easy. <laughs> weird. They actually didn't mention very many things. <laughs> I'm still thinking of them. I just really want to make We're sure. We're saying it's easy to do it but there's not a lot yes things. it's like there's one thing and you're done it's easy but guys we loved hanging out with these two there's we hope you enjoyed ever. hanging out with us you. now we're heading home yes tomorrow, tomorrow morning bright and early 4 30 in the morning <laughs> next time you turn on youtube you're gonna see us back at home with our kids in utah Aww. all right see you everybody bye, bye.